Good evening, humans. Transor Smoth here, and tonight we're taking a look at the ringside exclusive NJPW Jushin Thunder Liger debut attire figure from Storm Collectibles. I don't need to tell you that Jushin Thunder Liger is an absolute icon, especially in NJPW and Japanese wrestling in general. Uh, really an icon in worldwide wrestling, especially once you start to get into it. So, you know, obviously just an incredible wrestler and, uh, you know, it's really cool that we got a figure of him in this debut attire since he's certainly more known for the uh, look that he would have a little bit later on. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get right in this review. Let's do this. Aesthetically speaking, Thunder Liger here looks absolutely fantastic and honestly would not expect any less from Storm Collectibles. They just knock it out of the park a lot. Um, this definitely has a lot of notes that tend to be very specific to uh, Storm Collectibles, however, it definitely is very distinctly Thunder Liger as well. Uh, so looking at, I guess we'll start off with the head sculpt and you got that original mask. I love this mask, by the way. I actually pretty much, I, I think I prefer this to uh, his later look, the look he's certainly known for, but I mean, there's, there's a certain Vega from Street Fighter quality to this, um, even though it predates it. And uh, yeah, just really love it the way they, they have the the breathing holes here, just everything looks really cool. You can see the details in the eyes there. You get the kind of cross hatching. Uh, we get the nice, like the teal blue looks really nice throughout the costume. The shade of gold is spot on. Um, and again, uh, as I'd kind of said a few minutes ago, or a few minutes ago, a few seconds ago, uh, you know, you get that heft that you get with Storm Collectibles figures. So, I mean, definitely very, pr pretty accurate to his physique. However, you know, maybe just a slight bit heavier and just that, again, that's that Storm Collectibles bulk. And uh, yeah, just Sculpt is absolutely fantastic. And again, would not expect any less from them. Um, as you can see, paint all over the back as well. Just everything is touched up. Uh, the metallics shine, the mats uh, are perfectly matte. Uh, pardon this little bit, little bit of shininess on the delt here. Uh, this arm was sticking and I have not, I had not used shock oil until this figure <laughs> and uh, uh, went a little overboard. So I still got to clean that up. But uh, yeah, the, that should look like the other arm. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, and then we come to the boots and boots are super well sculpted and they've got that particular gold that did um, look different from the rest of the ring gear. So just a really just kick ass looking figure. So that's aesthetics. When it comes to accessories, basically all we get is an assortment of hands. However, that is really what you want with a wrestler. So uh, that definitely no complaining there. So let's get right into it. And right out of the package, of course, we have a set of fists. So you can see those. Then we have a couple of pointing hands. Then a set of grappling hands. Then we get a couple of posed hands. These are probably my favorite of the bunch. And then finally, a couple of gripping hands. So I mean, obviously he doesn't come with any accessories for which, with which to grip, but uh, you know, definitely can you know, put, put chairs or whatever else so from your other wrestling figures. So uh, that is accessories. Articulation balance are absolutely fantastic as you can see right here. So uh, let's break it down from top to bottom. And uh, a lot of stuff that we've seen from a lot of Storm Collectibles before. Uh, so our head is on that barbell joint that goes into kind of a top piece here at the top uh, of the torso. Uh, so we're gonna get about that far down. We're gonna get to look pretty good with the up. We get some really nice tilt too. You can hear a little bit of the creaking that is the kind of frame in here. Uh, we come to the shoulders. We do have really generous butterfly joints. Start coming all around there. We also get a little bit of up and down. Oh, and uh, as you can see, well, there's the assembly. So as you can see, there's a little bit of a frame in there. Um, and they do pop out, which I, which is nice. <laughs> I do like that because it, you know, obviously stops breaking, breakage. Uh, we can come directly into our T. We have bicep swivel. We have double jointed elbows, which unfortunately only bring us to 90 degrees. But again, it is a beefy figure. Uh, we have those ball joints on the wrists, so as you can see right there. Um, so you can go pretty much any way you want. Then we come to the diaphragm, and that is 
coming forward and back. Uh, you do get a little bit of side to side, but that's mainly gonna come from here at the waist. Uh, as you can see, the, the kind of gear is uh, <laughs> uh, unaligning, if you will. Uh, so we're gonna get about that much crunch. We're gonna get about that much back. And of course we get some rotation. Coming to the hips, almost full splits, absolutely beautiful. And uh, that'll allow you to see that we do get our thigh swivel from that assembly right there. We have double jointed knees, which again are kind of just past 90, not a, an incredible amount of range. Uh, the one thing I am sad about with this figure though is no boot cut or shin cut whatsoever. Uh, so you don't get that rotation. And then we come to the foot and uh, we're getting some pretty, pretty okay point. We're getting some decent forward. We have a toe joint as well. And then we get some really generous rocker. So that's articulation. Getting into size comparisons, here he is with some other wrestling figures. With some Hasbro. With some other imports. With some monsters. Finally, with Articulated Icons Oni and yours truly in human form as an Articulated Icons Ninja. So my final thoughts on the ringside exclusive uh, Jushin Thunder Liger debut attire figure from Storm Collectibles is that this is an absolutely kick-ass figure and honestly, uh, if you have any interest in NJPW and Jushin Thunder Liger as a wrestler and professional wrestling figures, uh, professional wrestling as a whole, uh, absolutely pick this up. And even I'm gonna add to that by saying if you are at all curious about um, Storm Collectibles and kind of like what their whole deal is, this is honestly a fantastic starting point. And at the $30 price tag, as of the recording of this video, you're crazy to pass that up. <laughs> uh, again, the, the only um, the only bad thing I can say about it, or not, not bad thing, the only real, real like criticism I have is the lack of boot swivel. That's really kind of a killer for the posing, but uh, everything else is spot on. And like, if you were are curious about Storm Collectibles, this is a very good distillation of kind of their design philosophy and uh, articulation philosophy. So yeah, definitely pick it up if you're interested. As I have said, it is a ringside exclusive. Um, so I will include a link below in the description uh, for where you can pick it up, which is ringside. <laughs> uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching and I hope you found this review informative and somewhat entertaining. And if you did, please consider liking, commenting, subscribing, and or sharing. And if you wanna take it to the next level and help me even more, I will have ways to do that listed at the bottom of the description. So please, please, please check those out. And uh, with all that being said, ultra thanks to you for watching and I hope you take care of yourself, take care of those around you, and most importantly, stay weird, Simeons. <laughs>